I really do time management because God is very special. Whether you are rich or poor, good looking, bad looking, male or female, everybody gets only 24 hours. There is somebody, there is nobody who gets 48 hours. You have to manage, what are your, you have to prioritize what you want to do. Like I hardly attend any wedding. Rarely. I consider it's a waste of time. Two of them are getting married. Wish from your home, I feel. That's my way of looking at it. <laughs> I, I was a professor of computer science in Christ University. My students get married and now they have also become mothers and teenage children they have. If it's Malayshwaram, I wish them sitting at home. No, I won't come. Even after metro, it takes time. <laughs> I don't waste time in you know, just like that, whiling away time, sitting there, you know, making a comment. No, I don't do that. I calculate every, every hour whether I can convert that into any fruitful things or not. Lot of reading I do on my journey. I travel 20 days in a month and I do a lot more in, on my journey. And I keep a good habit of walking every day. Every day I walk for an hour or something. And that time I'll think over it, what work I have to do in my mind, I will prepare a checklist. End of the day, before I go to bed, I will check whether I have completed or not. We get 500 emails a day, but as much as possible, we reply on the same day. Don't leave, it goes on accumulating. I get 5,000 invitation to talk. I take a single digit, maximum nine. Not more than that. You have to, otherwise you go on cutting the ribbon, giving a talk everywhere. There is nothing to talk much also actually. <laughs> <laughs> then when you do your work, my dad used to tell me this joke. His classmate, my dad got a first class in olden days. His, his classmate got a first rank. So I asked him, what happened to your classmate who got a first rank? Must have been in a good job. He said, no, he failed. I said, how? Because he got a first rank. So people around in the Dharwad area, Every day somebody will call him and honor him, you know, because some a young boy has got. So he spent all his time in, you know, attending all this honoring function. <laughs> End of the year, he said he failed. And I was a first class student, so I pa passed. I was an average student, I passed first class. Okay? The man who, uh, who would have been really bright, he failed and he got into depression, then he became a clerk somewhere, you know. So my dad used to tell me, don't, don't spend time in celebration all the time attending all these things. You know, it's fun once in a while, it's fun. But if you make it a habit, I sleep at 9.30 sharp every day, but about 4.30 sharp, irrespective of whatever is the schedule. So you have to be very disciplined. I'm very disciplined. Keep my diary. Without diary, I won't go anywhere. I have my old-fashioned two diaries we keep. Because I know time is very, very precious. And if, I'm sure I think, uh, you know, at your age also I was like that, but now I become much more than that. So I'm sure you will learn that is not a difficult thing, but you have to make your you have to make up your mind. Time is precious, I will not waste it.